So here we are, I think it's May 25th. And I just, I just bought this new mower here. I got it running. I'll shut her down. I just bought this new mower here. And there was a couple things that I wanted to point out about this thing. Obviously, the tag there. <laughs> There's a tag. Another tag here. Right down there, you see that one. I'm just boogie around here quickly. Another tag here. These are all signs of this mower being brand new. And if if I was to lay money on it, I would say that this mower is in fact brand new. Look at the tires. Look at this tire. See the green strip? See the red? See the red strips? Boy, this thing is fresh off the showroom floor. I'll guarantee ya. So, like I said, this is a 2016 model. This puppy is brand new, guaranteed. I can, I can smell it in the motor when I fire it up. You can smell a newness in the motor, which is a good thing. Now, last year, I bought a Toro, supposedly brand new. And you know, I was excited, I was in a hurry, I was, anything was new to me, I just wanted a zero turn, I didn't investigate it at all, I didn't feel there would be a need to investigate it. But what I can tell you, that I would notice, that just, that's happiness. You say, God, this thing is brand new. You see these strips, you see all of the tags, you know, you see everything. That thing didn't have any of that on it. The sticker here, that time cutter sticker there, that was peeling off. That was right next door to being peeled off. I have pictures of that. Not in suspicion, just taking pictures of the new mower. Little did I know. So anyway, you know, that leads me to uh, wonder, you know, it just makes me wonder. That that mower, is it last year, the, the mower that I bought last year? It was a 2012 model, and I bought that thing last year, which was 2015. Like I said, any zero turn, I needed a zero turn, I was jonesing for a zero turn, any zero turn, even, even as used as that thing appeared to be now that I look back on things, would do, and I had zero complaint. Uh, now that mower is in Missoula being fixed. Last year it started consuming oil. Last year I had wiring problems up touch with it. They nigger rig this thing, or that thing, like you would never believe. They disassembled the seat safety system so the thing would start. They, like I said, last year it all began, you know, they were, I was dumping oil into it and they were doing all kinds of altercations with the wiring harness. Well, it was new to me, never been on a zero turn before in my life, you know. It was new to me, and it was just fine, and it was just probably growing pains with the mower. Had no idea. But now when I get on this new, brand new mower, 2016 model, I can tell you that uh, I'm going to investigate this thing. I don't think that it's right for me to buy what I think is a brand new mower and have it be, as it turns out, for that price used mower and I will make damn sure that I have that thoroughly investigated anyway that's just a little video of uh, of this fabulous Toro I do give Toro a huge amount of credit for the fine quality of machine they build let's see how they stand by their word